Isang mainit na pagbati mula dito sa Phil Oil Flying V Center sa lungsod ng San Juan kung saan kakabukas lamang ng bagong liga para sa ating mga minamahal na volleyballista sa Pilipinas. Ito ang opening day ng Premier Volleyball League. Maraming salamat po sa lahat ng mga nakatutok ngayon sa SNA at pinabati din po namin ang lahat ng mga volleyball fans who are watching right now for the first time ever via our multi-cam live stream sa Premier VolleyballLeague.com Anim na talentadong kumunan sa sabak sa aksyon ngayong araw at magsisimula ang mga laban sa pagharap ng Lady Jet Spikers at ng Water Defenders Yan po ang ating unang laban dito sa Premier Volleyball League, the inaugural PVL sa ABS-CBN Pagkatapos ng laban ng Jet Spikers at ng Water Defenders mapapanood din natin ang bakbakan sa pagitan ng Power Smashers at ng Lady Warriors and finally we will be witnessing a showdown to close out our opening day matches with a matchup between the Cool Smashers and the Perlas Lady Spikers Mabuhay Pilipinas at maraming salamat po sa inyong pagtutok ngayon sa SNA Ako po ang inyong lingkod Anton Rojas and I am honored to be joined by one-time UAP champion Andre Mulia at isa sa mga rising TV host ngayon sa ating bansa, Angelique Manto. Good afternoon, girls, and welcome to the opening of the Premier Volleyball League. Good afternoon. And hindi na talaga mapipigilan ang patuloy na pagsikat ng volleyball dito sa Pilipinas. What does it mean para sa mga fans ng sport sa mga manlalaro na magkaroon ng isang liga katulad ng Premier Volleyball League? Well, of course, para sa mga manlalaro natin, no, this is something that uh, they can look forward to. Uh, something that can give them more exposure pagdating sa pag-ohon ng kanilang uh, talento. At uh, para naman sa mga fans, syempre, this is something that they can enjoy. Dito nila pwedeng makita ang kanilang mga hinahanga ang uh, volleyball players. And this is also one way for the fans to connect to us and the players. At excited tayong lahat para mapanood Ito ang ating mga magigiting na manlalaro ng volleyball ngayon. Ngayon, Angelique, I have to congratulate you kasi hindi ka lamang uh, permanent bahagi ng ating panel of large. You're also doing well in terms of the hosting business. Congratulations and uh, welcome also to the broadcast. Thank you very much, Anton, and I'm very happy to officially be a part of the Premier Volleyball League kung last year. Eh, medyo nagko-cover or nagko-cover in lang ako para sa mga absent ngayon. Officially a part na and I'm very excited. Super excited then for sure yung viewers natin dahil kanina nga ay natunghayan natin yung opening ceremonies ng reinforced conference of the Premier Volleyball League kung saan nakita natin lahat ng teams sa Spikers Turf at Spikers Turf at dito sa Premier Volleyball League na women's teams at nakita, nakausap ko rin kanina si Sir Ricky Palu, head ng um, Sports Vision and um, si Sir Dino Lorena ABS-CBN Head of Integrated Sports at nabangkit nga nila yung bagong feature for our live stream viewers at yun nga yung multicam setup for our um, live stream viewers kung saan by the touch of their fingertips eh mahipili na nila kung ano yung view pero mag-focus muna tayo dun sa dalawang team Alam natin ko, Angelique, for game one. Mo. Alam ko nag-research kaya kaya go ahead uh, tell us about the teams na sasabak sa aksyon sa ating unang laban dito sa PVL. Anton and Anna bangkit nga natin na Lady Jet Spikers laban sa Water Defenders ng ating game one. Well, I could say na contrast yung dalawang team na to dahil yung Lady Jet Spikers veteran laden na so kumbaga may experience talaga sila dito sa Viliga at yun yung pinanghahawakan nila pagpasok nila sa reinforced conference samantalang sa uh, na naman sa Water Defenders naman eh nakita na, na nakita na natin sila last conference pero may bagong mukha na sila at ang interesting dito ay yung dalawang collegiate na teams ni coach Roger Gorayev ay pinagsama niya dito sa kapunan na to at sprinkled by imports and other fascinating players sa volleyball community din so truly two teams na magsasabak talaga sa mahirap na laban ngayon and sinabi nga ni Angelique na napanood na natin itong Lady Jet Spikers they're very familiar with each other so we can say na coming into this match they have the experience advantage pero it's always exciting na mapanood ang isang bagong kupuna nagsanin pwersa nga ang mga manalaro ni coach Roger Gorayev na nagre-represent 
sa San Sebastian at sa National University. That's right. At ang mga ang tanong palagi ng mga tao no pag nagsasanib where sa ang uh, dalawang malalakas na teams how well they will gel together at uh, syempre ang importante diyan na uh, Anton no makikita natin ngayon gaano kalakas at gaano uh, um, uh, katindi ang talento na mailalabas sila against uh, their opponent. Kaya naman, mas ilalanin pa natin ang husto, ang kumpara ni Coach Roger Goraev. Panoorin natin ang uh, interview. Pero bago yun, uh, pag-usapan muna natin, an ang magiging tournament format being that this is the first this is the first match and the first time that we are showcasing the PVL dito sa SNA at via live streaming. Well, Anton, for this uh, conference, itong, uh, meron tayong double round robin format kung saan uh, magkakatapat-tapat ang mga teams ng dalawang beses dito sa ating uh, conference and the top four teams will advance to the semifinals at pagkatapos naman ang teams number one and four ay maglalaban-laban teams two and three ay uh, maglalaban sa best of three uh, series and then the winners will advance to the best of three final series pero yung mga losers natin will also advance to a best of three battle for third. More matches, more excitement para sa mga players at sa mga fans. At sinabi ko nga, Angelique, meron tayong mga inihandang interviews para mas lalo pa nating makilala ang mga kukunan na sasabak sa aksyon. Ayun nga, Anton and Anne, new season, new conference, new teams, at meron din tayong mga newly composed teams at isa na siguro doon yung Water Defenders. Well, we have someone familiar standing in the form of Gretzel Solton as kanilang team captain, pero marami talagang bago sa kapunan na ito kaya naman mga kapamilya para kalilanin sila panoorin natin ito Handa nang makipagsabayan ang must improve ng kapunan ng Water Defenders para sa Premier Volleyball League Well, it's a new team, so the skill set, I think we each position is well covered and they're quite competitive. Providing the firepower sa team ni Coach Roger Goriet ay ang three-time NCAA MVP na si Gretzel Soltones. Sana makakuha namin yung goal namin ngayon as a team. Kahit makapasok man lang kami sa semifinals, yun lang muna for now. Siyempre, nakakatuwa, nakakatuwa kasi lahat naman kami love ni Coach Roger eh. Parati lang naman yung sinasabi sa amin na galingan na lang namin and kailangan focus lang parati, yun lang talaga. Tutulong din sa grupo ngayong season ang mga talents from National University. Isa na rito, ang spiker turned setter na si Jasmine Abor. Siyempre po sobrang excited kasi siyempre kahit bata pa lang po ako, nakakasama ko na po yung mga veteran, lalo na po sa mga ibang teams. So mas makakadagdag po yun sa experience po. Sa pagsasama ng dalawang matinik na volleyball programs ng Baste at NU, siguradong hahataw at magpapakitang gilas ang Water Defenders para sa inaasam na kampiyonato dito sa Reinforced Conference. Alam naman nating lahat na isang alamat pagdating sa Philippine Volleyball si Coach Roger Gurayev and I'm very interested to see what type of chemistry this new team will have uh, dahil nga nagsani puwersa ang kanyang mga manalaro from National University at sa San Sebastian pero meron din mga dinagdag na players ha? a uh, former legend from Adamson University si Lizzie Ann Pantone at uh, si Jerry Lee Malabana ng FU kasama din sa kuponan ni Coach Roger. That's right. At uh, itong uh, kuponan na to Anton na pag-usapan na natin uh, na marami nang uh, titulo na pinanghahawakan nitong si Coach Roger. Ang maganda dito, konti lang ang adjustments ng team pagdating sa pakikipag-interact uh, sa kanilang coach because both teams sanay na actually with Coach Roger. Ang tanong na lang dito, how the teams will gel with each other at uh, 
alam naman natin si Coach Roger nga talagang uh, alam na alam na niya ang mga weaknesses at strengths ng kanyang mga team. So dinagdagan pa niya ito, ni-reinforce pa niya ng uh, one of the best defenders that we've actually uh, seen sa UAAP noong kanyang panahon. Multi-awarded talaga si Liz Lian Pantone and it's great to see her in action again dito sa pagbubukas ng Premier Volleyball League. Angelique, we mentioned a while ago, we want to get in touch with the fans even more from a deeper perspective. So, can you tell us how they can uh, interact with us dito sa ating coverage? Kung kasing excited na rin namin kayo mga kapamilya sa Game 1 natin dito sa Reinforced Conference, pwedeng-pwede nyo kaming itweet sa at ABS-CBN Sports gamit ang ating official hashtag hashtag PBL PBL on ABS-CBN. And if you want more content like photos, videos, you could also visit and follow us on our Instagram account. That's at ABS-CBN underscore sports. At Anton, naalala nyo ba last year eh meron tayong first person view sa kung ano man yung nangyayari sa arena para sa ating mga viewers. Well, nandito pa rin yun for this conference. We still have the Ronda Camas yes. dahil bagong season nga. So, meron pang bagong feature kung saan yung mga members ng arena natin or yung audience natin eh makakasalamuha yung kanilang mga favorite players through our mobile photo booth. At ayun na nga, kanina ginawa namin yan uh, kasama yung mga ilang fans si Eliza Valdez yung maglalaro sa last game natin for today. So gamitin nyo lang po ang hashtag BBL on ABS-CBN. Subukan natin ipatrend ang hashtag na ito sa pagbubukas ng ating panibagong liga. Angelique, maraming salamat. Abangan pa namin ni Anne ang iyong mga updates mamaya. Pero sa aming pagpabalik, himayan pa namin ng gusto itong ating unang laban sa pagitan ng Lady Jets Bikers at ng Water Defenders dito sa opening day ng Premier Volleyball League. mga laban dito sa bagong tahanan ng namahal natin mga volleyballista sa Pilipinas aming ihandog sa inyo sa SNA at sa pamamagitan ng live stream sa premiervolleyballleague.com ito po ang opening day ng PVL ako po ang inyong lingkod ng Ton Rojas joined of course by former UAP champion Anne Remulia Kanda at Anne maganda ang ating bueno manong bakbakan as we have the Lady Jets Bikers taking on the Water Defenders that's right. Uh, ito nga yung pinag-uusapan natin uh, kanina, Anton, ano, that uh, these teams, um, itong maglalaban-laban ngayon, composed of a veteran team na sa ilalim ng uh, pamumuno ni uh, Coach Roger Gurayev at uh, isang team naman na inaabangan din talaga ng, uh, ng ating mga volleyball fans. So it's gonna be an interesting afternoon today. Tama ka, An. Yung Lady Jet Spikers, napanood natin nung nakaraang taon dito sa SNA. They're a very cohesive unit mm -hmm. at pinangungunahan sila ng... Last setter to have won the MVP award sa UAAP, I'm talking about Wendy Ann Semana, isang legendary na manalaro dito sa larangan ng Philippine Volleyball. Definitely itong si uh, Semana. Alam natin na ito at nasubaybayan natin ito. Nalaro na yata niya lahat ng pwesto na pwedeng uh, ipalaro sa kanya. So very versatile uh, player at uh, yan ang uh, aasahan din natin makita sa kanya dito sa conference na ito. At syempre, other notable names sa uh, kupuna ni Coach Jasper Jimenez, sina Joy Cases, Yari Yonko, Mean Pantino at Josemar Tapic. The usual suspects dito mm -hmm. sa Lady Jet Spikers na sinabi natin a very cohesive unit the familiarity will be key for them dito sa ating unang conference sa Premier Volleyball League Definitely at syempre pakaabangan natin ang kanilang mga leading scorers dito sa ligang ito nakita natin ang tapanggit mo kanina ang kanilang mga pangalan nandiyan sila Cases sila Tapic sila Semana and of course the rest of the team to really support them para sa labang ito At ang unang hamon na kanilang haharapin ay ang uh, Bakbakan, ang kanilang bakbakan kontra sa Water Defenders kung saan makakaharap nila si Gretzel Soltones, ang three-time MVP ng NCAA at nariyan din ang uh, isa sa mga bright young setters ng ating bansa na si Jasmine Napor. It is a fusion of Coach Roger Goreyev, San Sebastian and NU teams. In terms of experience, kung uh, sinabi natin ng isang team ay veterano, itong, itong uh, uh, nag-merge na team na ito under Coach Roger Gurayev, sanay din itong sumabak dahil uh, both these teams, of course, San Sebastian, na sweep nila ang elimination round so, na, sa nakaraang NCAA pagdating naman sa NU. Ito always a top contender itong team na to sa UAAP. Yun nga lang, no, hindi sinwerte itong parehong kupanan na to. So definitely, these teams, Anton, are hungry 
para makakuha ng panalo. Meron silang gustong patunayan and what better place to do that than right here sa unang araw ng pinakabagong tahanan para sa ating mga talented volleyballs dito sa Pilipinas. Ito po ang opening day ng Premier Volleyball League at sa aming pagpabalik, magsisimula na po ang ating unang laban. It is the Lady Jet Spikers and the Water Defenders dito lang sa SND at sa Premier Volleyball League DJ Tronics is back with us para mas lalo pang uh, ganahan ang mga fans, ang mga manalaro at tayo na rin dito, mga miyembro sa panel and DJ Tronics, as we saw last year he's always all out punong-puno ng energy itong si DJ Tronics kaya naman nakikita eh, natin ang mga Kasama natin sa live stream Billy Capistrano at Z Hervasho. Ayan, you can hear their thoughts and uh, join the conversation with them. Just go to sports.abs-cbn.com or premiervolleyballleague.com. And uh, Z's friend Cassie is also with them, enjoying the action here as we are about to begin. Itong labanan sa pagitan ng Water Defenders at ng Lady Jet Spikers. Officials for this match. Alright, pakinggan natin si First Coach referee, para sa introductions. Lopez. Second referee, Mr. Yule Benosa. Before we present our starters, we'd like to thank our friends from ASICS, the official Premier Volleyball League partner. And Mikasa, the official game, game ball of the PBL. And now, let's meet our starting lineup from our Lady Jet Spikers. Wearing jersey number four, Air Woman, second class, Iyari Yonko. At number six, Air Woman, second class, May Ann Pantino. Wearing jersey number seven, Air Woman, first class, Wendy Ann Semana. At number 12, team captain, Air Woman, second class, Joy Gazelle Cassis. Wearing jersey number 16, Air Woman, second class, Angeli May Antipuesto. And number 17, Air Woman, second class, Josamer Tapic. Libero is number five, Air Woman, second class, Mary Ann Balmaceda. Head coach, technical sergeant, Jasper Jimenez. Let us welcome our Ballet Pure Water Defenders. Team captain is number five, Gretchel Soltones. At number four, Jasmine Nabor. Wearing jersey number nine, Aiko Sweet Urdas. Number 11, Risa Sato. Number 12, Iris Oliveros. Number 14, Jarrell Singh. Libero, number 6, Lizley Ann Pantone. Head coach, Mr. Roger Gorayev. This is our first match in our Premier Volleyball League. Ang kauna-unahang match dito sa pagbubukas ng Premier Volleyball League. Aarangkada na starting lineups para sa Lady Jet Spikers at sa Water Defenders. Nakikita natin ang mga usual names mm -hmm. para sa kumbunan ni Coach Jasper Jimenez. Pero para naman sa squad ni Coach Roger Goreb, as we said, it's a mixture of NU and San Sebastian players. The big question was kung sino yung mga malalaro na kanyang ipapasok sa starting lineup who are not from San Sebastian and NU at nakikita natin dito si Lizlian Pantone who was a three-time best digger and one-time best receiver in the UAAP as a player for Adamson. That's right. And, uh, alam mo, matagal nang nag-graduate si uh, Pantone. No? Uh, she used to be uh, called uh, Lizlian Gata. Gata pa yung kanyang last name. At hanggang ngayon, matunog na matunog pa rin ang pangalan niya. Ganun uh, katindi yung markang naiwan niya. She will reinforce the floor defense Para sa Water Defenders dito sa laban na to, unang puntos ng Premier Volleyball League nagmula dito kay Josimer Tapic. 
natin. Ito yung mga pangalan na sinabi natin, pakaabangan natin mula sa Lady Jet Spikers. At magsisimula ang lahat kay Wendy Ann Semana, former UAP MVP, the last setter to have become MVP in the UAP. And that's astonishing considering maraming magagaling na setter ngayon. So, bihira tayo makakita ng setter na nagiging MVP sa UAAP. Si Wendy Ansemana po ang uh, naging MVP na, na setter. Huling setter na naging MVP. Samantala, Jorel Singh nakakuha ng regalo. Jasmine aboard tipping it to Risa Sato. Back set napunta dito kay Yari Iyonko. Pantone. Binigay kay Soltones. Pumalo mula sa likod. Panibagong pagkakataon para kay Iyonko who goes cross court. Look at the defense. From the back row, and both teams actually is displaying excellent defense. Tina mo walang na mamatay na bola so far. Oh, sarado ang pintuan. Josimer tapping again. Maganda ang kanya pinapakita sa simula ng laban nito. Nakuha ng jet spikers ang puntos na yon, but nothing to be ashamed of para dito sa side ng sa abal up. Water defenders. Water defenders. Water defenders wearing blue, nakaputi naman with yellow, the usual colors for the Air Force, Philippine Air Force, Lady Jet Spikers. Doing more for a quicker place, ang water defenders. Look at this. At sa ngayon, it's just playing smart volleyball so far para sa kapunan ni Coach Roger Gorayeb. At nakaswerte doon si Risa Sato from Osaka with love. Patay ang swerte. Nasa side nila ngayon. Ano ang feeling ng mga players ngayon naglalaro sa isang panibagong liga? The first ever match in a brand new chapter of Philippine Volleyball. Alam mo, the feeling is always that yung excitement. Excitement is always there. Definitely that maging part ka ng history. It's the first ever game at para sa kapunan ng Water Defenders and Jet Spikers. Pareho itong teams na to, syempre. You enter a tournament or you join a tournament with the intention of wanting to win. Diba? Wanting to win. Kanina nga lang, sinabi ni Gretchel nung ating pre-game interview. Very humble nga eh. Sinasabi niya, semis muna. Yun muna ang aming pagtatrabahuhan, hindi muna yung championship ang kanilang nasa isa. It's really about winning. And I think that's because alam niya yung klase ng competition Oo. na kanilang hangarapin dito sa reinforced conference ng PVL. We've got all the six teams na magpapakitang gilas ngayong araw on opening day. Uh, mamaya mapapanood natin ang Power Smashers taking on the Lady Warriors. And then finally the Cool Smashers will play the Burlas Lady Spikers at si Ate Ivy mo maglalaro mamaya. So, uh, how excited are you for that? Very excited. <laughs> <laughs> Aabangan ko yan. Samantala, Wendy Ann Semana tossing it up to Yari Yonko. Putos para sa Lady Jet Spikers. Tabla ang ating laban. Dikit ang ating simula. Ooh. Napaka napalakas si Antipuesto that time. Fading back para mapalo yung bola. 5-4 to four ang ating talaan pabor sa water defenders. As we have Jorel Singh. Very uh, deadly server. Na naglalaro para sa National University Soltones. Challenge rin para sa water defenders na matuto si Jasmine aboard to play with someone like Gretzel Soltones. Balikan muna natin ang ating kasamang si Angelique Manto. Angelique? Anton and Anne, we have been mentioning about all things new dito sa PBL on ABS-CBN. Pero ang Lady Jet Spikers are not treating the old as a disadvantage. As a matter of fact, this old familiarity and experience is something they are putting a premium to. Ang kapampangang kapitan na pangana si Wendy Semana ang nagsabi na buong buo pa at very intact pa ang open conference championship core nila from last season. At veterano na rin maituturing itong si Wendy dahil simula pa lamang ng V-League noong 2004 ay naglalaro na pala ito. Pero may bago din naman sa Lady Jet Spikers dahil for the first time mula na maglarong sila sa V-League ay mayroon 
Mayroon na silang import na si Pachari Sang Muang na bagaman we won't be seeing some action from today and dapat pa rin natin yan abangan sa mga susunod nilang laro, Anton and Ann. Maraming salamat, Angelique, for that update. When the Ann Semana, sinabi nga ni Angelique na she's been here from the very beginning. At uh, naikwento sa akin ni Wendy na she used to be a libero. Yep. Tapos naging setter. Converted ha, from libero to setter. Tapos naging setter spiker pa. And she's a former UAP champion na naglaro para sa FEU. So she's been through it all in terms of volleyball. Oh. Literally. Oh, all positions. At uh, para sa kanilang uh, import ano, na si Pacharisa Mo, hindi rin yan bago dito sa paglalaro ng volleyball sa Pilipinas. So uh, may familiarity niya rin kung baga. At sigurado ako, oh, oh, pati mga fans, sigurado ako ah, na abangan nila ang paglalaro ng mga reinforcements nga dito sa Reinforced Conference sa PBL. Semana, tossing it up. And... Pan Pantone is able to, uh, Pantino, excuse me, Mayan Pantino is able to get the point here para sa Lady Jet Spikers. Si Pantino ang isa sa mga agresibong attackers dito sa Air Force. Hindi siya kasintangkad ng ibang mga open spikers, pero laging ready to fly, ready to hit yan. And uh, it's more of consistency actually para kay uh, Pantino. Samantala, yung patama ni Jorel Singh, dumiretso sa net. Timeout muna tayo lamang ang Lady Jet Spikers kontra sa Water Defenders, 8-7. to seven. One of the bright young stars of Philippine Volleyball, EJ Laure at ibang klaseng puso ang kanyang pinakita Aww. sa Final Four. Uh, playing with a sprained ankle and the mamathlete is making her comeback today Phil Kainet Cayetano she's been waiting for this yeah. for a long time and she's been training so hard the past couple of months mapapanood po natin si Phil Kainet Cayetano back in action in our second match as the Power Smashers take on Phil and the Lady Warriors ngayon sinabi ko as uh, Soltones gets the point Sinabi ko, we encourage everybody to get involved with the discussion. Gamitin ang hashtag PVL on ABS-CBN. At grabe, an aktibo. Aktibo yung mga uh, viewers. May mga nagtitweet sa akin na sinasabi nila na si Rhea Demokalangan daw yung naging last setter na naging MVP. Pero finals MVP po yung uh, napanaluna ni Rhea Demakulangan nung season 72 pero yung regular season MVP si Wendy Ann Simana po yung huling setter na naging MVP sa UAAP so maraming salamat sa lahat ng mga aktibong nagtitweet sa amin so keep them coming uh, we hope you enjoy the coverage ang ating panibagong uh, liga uh, ba panibagong kabanata ang pagsisimula ng Premier Volleyball League Nabor to Soltones a back row bomb from Soltones. At uh, kita naman natin, no, isa sa mga strategy din talaga at uh, pinupuntahan palagi ng uh, sets dito sa side ng uh, water defenders. Talagang si Soltones pa rin, whether she's in front or at the back, talagang high percentage uh, attacker itong uh, si Gretchel. Off the block. Samantala, Semana. Binigay kay Tapik. Si Tapik ang mainit ngayon eh, dito sa simula ng laban na to, Ann. Mainit, very uh, aggressive at uh, yun nga, both teams actually yung nakikita natin, hindi pa lumalayo ng uh, sobra, no? wala pang team na lumalaki ang lamang. And it's because both teams are really playing smart at as I say that, uh, nagkaroon ng miscom itong si, uh, uh, sa kanilang play, si Sato at si Nabor. Jasmine Nabor. And... Sinabi nga natin, natin kanina, and it's an adjustment for Jasmine na maglaro sa panibagong kupunan and uh, with new teammates to incorporate. Gaya na lamang ni Gretzel Soltones. Pantino. Nabor. Pinigay kay Jorel. Off the block. Popped up by Semana. Yonko over the blockers. Soltones was there. Quick attack para kay Sato. Tuloy pa rin ng rally. Pantino. Umadjust. Nabor Binali kay Singh no Sarado ang pintuan Great blocking Shown here by Philippine Air Force Tamang pagbabasa Magandang timing Yan ang uh, ipinakikita sa atin Ng blockers Ng uh, Jet Spikers Ngayon po Sir, si Wendy Ann Semana. Semana The heart and soul 
And then Lady Jet Spikers and the extension of Coach Jasper Jimenez. And even that, oh, uh, sa end line. So the Jet Spikers get that point. Samantala, sa kabilang panig naman, seryosong seryoso si Coach Roger Gureb. Panibagong hamon naman nito para kay Coach Roger to try to generate some chemistry. But uh, we see Sato and Nabor continuing their strong play nung sila uh, magkasama during the previous year and uh, playing for National University. Itong si uh, Coach Roger, kahit na hindi naman ganun kalaki yung kalamangan pa no, ng, ng kalaban nila, is really a perfectionist at yan ang alam natin sa kanya. So these uh, points na nakukuha ng uh, Jet Spikers, hindi natutuwa itong si uh, Coach Roger and he's probably expecting more mula sa kanyang komponan. Nakatayo si Coach Roger. Oh. <laughs> Intense look eh, on his face kung nakikita nyo. Arms crossed, samantala, uh -huh. Jorel Singh. Singh, turn back. Now signaling uh, itong uh, substitution. Yeah, this is uh, Jeremy Malabanan who plays for Far Malabana. Eastern University. We have to get used to her in blue. Yep. <laughs> but uh, of course, she, she's still Continue. representing FEU. Nakikita natin yung verde na, green, na, na Touch of green. leg sleeve on her left leg. So, Jeremy Malabanan at size with a serve. and versatility para sa water defenders dito sa laban na to. Set was too low para kay Tapi. Jerry Malabanan can play utility, middle, and open spiker. And she reinforces the blocking ngayon para sa water defenders. Kasama niya sa harap si Urdas at si Oliveros. Sato. Nabor, back set para kay Urdas. Tuloy pa rin ang rally. Regalo! Malabanan and Oliveros. Malabanan takes advantage of that. And we were just talking about her size. Ayan, two hands for safety. Jeremy Malabanan, unang puntos. Dito sa Premier Volleyball League para sa kanya. Semana, quick attack. Josimer Tapic continues to pile up the points. Para sa Lady Jet Spikers, alam mo, historic ka na yung kanyang uh, unang puntos mm -hmm. kanina. Siya ang, she will always be remembered as the player who scored the first, first point, point for the PBL. So these two teams played the first ever game and she's the first ever player who scored a point. Magandang ano yun. And uh, we're very, part to, we're very uh, happy to be a part of history here mm -hmm. today. Panibagong tahanan ng uh, minamahal nating volleyball players ng Premier Volleyball League. And the Lady Jet Spikers are in control early on. They lead the Water Defenders 16 to 14. Ayan po si Jovi Prado. Excited na excited ng sumabak sa action. They will be playing in the second match against Coach Romel Abelias, Lady Warriors. So, very interesting dahil uh, Coach Romel uh, being a former libero for USD is now a coach and was very successful last year. Tapos si Jovi Prado, lumevel up and team captain na siya. Wow! At uh, yun nga, ano, maganda nakikita natin yung changes ng compositions ng team or yung minsan pati pwesto ng player or yung uh, kanilang nilalarong pwesto nagbabago din. But, uh, parang promotion din yun. Promotion to a team captain. <laughs> And it's, it's a huge responsibility because we know as an open spiker, inaasahan si Jovi Prado na maging scorer, but to also lead is another challenge as Yari Yonko, one of the most energetic players from the Lady Jet Spikers. Siya yung energizer bunny ng Kubonan, Anne. Service. Tapic. meanwhile, one of the steadiest players. And as I say that right on cue, service ace. How does it feel getting that ace ano, sa, uh, against a uh, libero pa? Ito si uh, Pantone. Eh. Doon siya nakascore. Pahinga natin si Coach Roger. Nihintay niyo silang mag-treat at sis. Eh. Tingnan niyo yung kilos ng malaban. Dalawang beses na yan. Eh. Biglaan nga tatalo. Papaloy kasi dikit yung bola sa nit. Eh. Pwede nang baluin. Eh. Ha? Sa pangan niyo lagi dito sa likod. Depensa. Pag dumipensa kayo, huwag tayong nakabukaka na sobra-sobra. Hindi na 
kayo makakakilos. Ah, tapos ipagay niya yung black dun sa harapan doon. Okay, maghintay ng 3 touches nila bago kayo pa-black. Anytime pwede mo. Your thoughts on the words of the legend, Coach Roger Goreyev. At nakikita po natin si Terence Estacio at si Jojo Estacio, who is the head of SNAHD. Very happy family enjoying the opening of the Premier Volleyball League dito sa SNA. But uh, tignan natin, ano, kanina during that huddle, Anton, ang reminders ni Coach Roger. At mo hindi pa nakakapag-adjust ng kanyang team is more of their stance pagdating sa pagdepensa at pag-receive. As sinasabi nga niya, baka naman masyado yung position nyo or yung uh, inyong uh, posture hindi tama, hindi na kayo makagalaw. Uh, let's see if they can adjust. Dahil uh, unti-unti na rin uh, lumalayo ang Jet Spikers. And we also have... Our boss from SNA, Head of Integrated Sports, Mr. Dino Laurena, talking to the one and only Mr. Richard Gomez. And we're very lucky to have him here also in the men's division, the PVL. I'm sure a lot of fans are waiting to watch that he's going to play volleyball. Yonko could not get through the block. Regalo para kay Aiko Urdas, but... Oh, that point goes to the Jet Spikers. Umalog yung net. Oh, and uh, of course, it happened right in front of our first referee. Ayun. Yun. Nakita yung uh, reaction at the net. Yariyongpo, serving for the Lady Jet Spikers. The boar back set para kay Urdas, Urdas. off the block. The block. 16 to 20. Aiko Urdas serving for the water defenders. Semana, hindi na na yung bola. Ooh. At hindi na rin na napalusot. Pagpunta sa kabilang side, ano? some errors from the Jet Spikers it allowing the water defenders to inch a little bit closer. Ayan po, mga reinforcements ng water defenders. Jennifer Brooke Keddy and Bwali. Jeng Bwali. Ayan, si Bwali hindi na rin yan bago na... Um, with my volleyball dito sa Pilipinas. She's been uh, in and out of the country uh, playing volleyball with uh, San Sebastian College, actually. Ina with Coach uh, Roger. Inaantay pa nila yung karilang ITC or International Transfer Labor. Certificate, which is usually the document na kailangan isecure na mga manalaro who are playing overseas. So until that documentation is um, processed and released, for now, no, hihintayin natin yan. But uh, hopefully soon, I'm sure yung mga fans uh, inaabangan ng kanilang uh, uh, paglalaro dito sa ating conference na ito. And I'm sure excited na rin ang ating mga reinforcements na sumabak. Oh, yung kasama ni Z kanina, uh, kahit hindi pa naglalaro, sumabak na rin sa ating live stream. Which is uh, one of the new components ng ating broadcast. Meron po tayo multi-cam live stream coverage bagong experience po para sa inyo mga volleyball fans to enjoy the PVL Pachari uh, Sangmua of course very excited na sumabak dito sa PBL 
siya lang ang uh, nag-iisang import sa Lady Jet Spikers. So, may mga kumpunan na uh, dalawa ang uh, reinforcement. Uh, meron naman uh, isa laba. So, Jet Spikers are one of those teams that only employ one reinforcement. And like Anne mentioned earlier, we cannot wait for them to finally see action. 23 to 19 ang ating talaan. Lady Jet Spikers ng una kontra sa Water Defenders. Serve ni Soltones. Semana. Saved by Pantone. Malabanan. Tuloy pa rin ang rally. Semana. Binigay kay Mean Pantino. Soltones. Drop ball from the back row. Well read. Nabasa ng maigiang depensa ng Jet Spikers. Hang out. Air Force. Ayan po, good play for Sultones. Let's listen in to Coach Jasper. Kung sa kasama ay mas malapit yun, mas nakita mo, mas basa mo, ha? Galaw tayo, galaw tayo. Hindi natin pwede pabayaan yung ganun. Chansa na yun, eh. Okay? O sige, daan-daan tayo. Bawi ka agad, bawi ka agad, ha? Ha? Okay. Sige, kunin natin. Kuha tayo isa lang muna. Okay? Sige, get. Tama pa, tama pa. Ayan po si Jasper Jimenez who is an Adamson alumnus. Middle hitter as a player. And now the head coach itong uh, Lady Jet Spikers. Nabor. Binigay kay Malabanan. And Jeremy Malabanan looking good with, with her new team. Good execution and uh, even better target Service. para kay Malabanan. Ooh! Masakit yun. Oh, oh, not uh, the best the lady time to commit. A, uh, actually, never a good time ano, para mag-commit ng uh, service error. But lalo na at this point na malapit ng maisa na ng Jet Spikers itong first set. Kaya ano pa, peace sign na lang si Gretzel eh. <laughs> at tumawa. With the hopes of, uh, na parang mapalighten naman yung mood. Lady Jet Spikers susubukan tapusin ang set number one. And Pantino is able to Take set number one sa pamamagitan ng isang cross-court attack na tumama sa kanto. Well-placed hit by Mean Pantino ng Lady Jet Spikers. They take the first set dito sa ating makasaysayang unang laban sa Premier Volleyball League.